Okay, so today we'll be talking about Origins and Clinique. Both of these masks are meant to be an additive to your skincare routine to boost hydration and make sure your skin looks hydrated, glowy, and plumped up the next morning. Um, benefits on this ones, we're gonna be talking about them and then price-wise too. So this one retails for $35 and it is a 3.4 ounces, while Origins is a 2.5 ounces, if I'm not mistaken, it is 2.5 ounces, and it also retails for $26. Now they do have one for a mini one for one ounce, and it retails for $13. Um, so the main difference for me as uh, the consistency is that Clinique Moisture Search is more of a creamy consistency. Now it is oil free, that's what it claims to do on the website so it does has that pinkish undertone this kind of looks like my my door right here while um it is it tends to be more creamy like i said um but it doesn't have any oil so if you're on the oilier side and you're scared to use that one this product right here i i'm and say go ahead and try it give it a sample try it out and see if, see if it works for your skincare benefits now we're going to talk about a little bit about Origins. So this is the Drink Up Intensive Overnight Hydrating Mask. And now this ones have gone through so many process and changes. Um, there was one for uh, the breast cancer awareness. There's also been a couple of them that have changed. This one has avocado and Swiss oil, which is going to help you to relax. It's going to help you to nourish your skin and make sure it stays hydrated. Uh, the, the difference for me from Moisture Search and this ones are going to be the next ones that I'm going to tell you right now. So Origins has a little bit more ingredients that are going to be more anti-aging. Um, I went ahead and from the whole list of the ingredients that each of them have, I went ahead and broke down a couple of them because I just wanted to make sure that I can give you guys that kind of a difference and and the benefits and then I search a little bit more just to make sure I was correct with the products. So uh, Trink Up Intensive Overnight um, has avocado. It claims to do 72 hour hydration because it also has hyaluronic acid, which I'm actually right now putting on my skin. Has a little bit on the yellow one while Moisture Search is more pinky. Uh, this one has a little bit more of a avocado scented. It's not something if you don't like avocados, don't get scared and don't get carried away. It's not gonna feel that way and it's not gonna feel like you're putting avocados on your skin. It's just more nourishing and it definitely appeals more to the nose or to your scents. Um, as you guys can see, when I apply it and when I massage, when I massage this product onto my, my skin, it immediately supples. Well, the moisture search, I think you have to kind of work it out a little bit more. Uh, but definitely, those are the main benefits of those or the main difference. Uh, the Drink Up Intensive Overnight Mask, this is a, has hyaluronic acid. So while you're sleeping, it attracts all the moisture that are, it's in the environment to make sure that your skin stays hydrated and plumped. Uh, main ingredients are water, which is mainly to use to uh, hydrate your skin. The next one is glycerin to help helps your skin to be conditioned and nourished. The next one is called Cetyl Alcohol, which is this product right here has still alcohol to be uh, kind of a emollient and um, help you to create that barrier so your skin stays hydrated the whole time. The next ingredient is called Glycerin Polymetacrylate. It's a, it has hydrating powers to bond and to um, make sure you, that hydration always stays within your skin and it never leaves your skin. Uh, the next ingredient is called Niacinamide, which is a um, derivative from vitamin B3, which vitamin B3 is amazing for the skin just because it has that kind of a, it vents out your skin texture, it helps you with the cell turnover of the skin. It's also really good for pores and lines, fine lines and wrinkles. So it's kind of like taking it up a notch from the moisture search because this one is kind of anti-aging. So you get that with this benefits. The next ingredient is called hydroxyethyl urea, which is gonna help you promote a natural, healthier looking, glorious, amazing skin. Uh, it's gonna help you even at your skin tone and it's gonna help your skin to stay as younger as possible because it helps the cell turn over overnight uh, with your skin. So what am I saying? It's, I'm gonna, it's gonna help your skin to be uh, brighter and looking the next morning. So the last ingredient that I actually wanted to dissect within the whole list is PEG75, which is gonna help you soothe and soften the skin texture of your skin. So it doesn't have that kind of like pores in the morning. So if you're applying um, makeup in the next morning, you're gonna love it. So the next one is gonna be Moisture Surge. 
So Moisture Search is mainly for hydration and it's an additive. So if you're using either um, Moisture Search Concentrate or 72 hour thirst or thirst relief or even the um, intense, you're probably gonna love this one to put it on top of your skin if you're more on the drier side. If it's winter, this is the best fit for you because it has water that make, makes sure that your skin stays hydrated. It also has glycerin, which is gonna condition your skin. Cetyl alcohol is gonna be, again, an emollient. The next one is gonna be dimethicone, which is gonna help you protect the, um, protect the mild irritation of your skin. Uh, so it's not gonna be like, um, a lot of people be like, oh, well, what if I'm allergic or what if I, this product is not good for me or what if it's just not going to be the best or what if I get an allergy so that's not going to happen with Clinique. They focus on happy skin so you take that and you're going to love it. And then um, the next one is called uh, Glycerin Polymer. I'll probably write it down for you guys. The next one is glycer uh, Glyceryl which is a strong hydrating power for your skin structure, so it creates that wall in your skin. And the last one is called Shea Butter uh, from the whole long list that I had. Uh, so the Shea Butter is gonna is rich in fatty acids and vitamins that are gonna help you soften in the skin texture. So you get those two with the, these two products right here. Now, if you're looking for more hydration, I would definitely go for this one. Not that this one doesn't do it, but this one has has taken it a, a little bit notch up there because it has more anti-aging benefits. Now, both of them are gonna do amazing for your skin. I've used this two uh, on and off and on and off all the time. I've actually used them also as a night cream because why not? Yeah, you know, sometimes I just don't feel like putting a lot of products on my skin, so I just put my retinol at night, and I just put my moisturizer, and it feels amazing. I don't see, if I'm using retinol, like right now at the moment, I am using still um, the Clinique uh, Overnight uh, Vitamin A, which is retinol, and it doesn't feel, my skin doesn't feel flaky, it doesn't feel like it's drying or peeling off or at all, even though when I was using the Elizabeth Arden or any other uh, products like uh, that contain retinol. Those products have helped me improve my skin and the skin hydrated uh, texture, so I would definitely recommend both of them. It only depends what you're looking for. Now remember, Origins is more of a plant-based and Clinique is more like paraben-free and non-animal tested, uh, or excuse me, paraben-free and non-animal tested, non-comedogenic, non-agnogenic, and it's all about no phthalates and happier skin. While well, this one is more for on the greenish side, it's more plant-based, derivatives uh, are gonna be more natural. So it's take and leave. Um, if you guys have any questions, make sure you comment down below and I'll make sure that you guys uh, are answered properly and as fast as I can. I'll see you guys soon. Make sure you subscribe to this channel and tell me how you guys like this new intro. I'll see you guys soon. Goodbye.